A couple of weeks ago, we announced the general availability of Ubuntu Confidential Virtual Machines on Microsoft Azure. It is the first and only Linux distribution to support Confidential Virtual Machines. In this video, I will show you how to launch them. But first, why is this important? Traditional solutions on the cloud offer data protection at rest and in transit. With this solution, the data is also protected while in use. The code and the data are isolated in a zero trust environment, where even the operating system and the cloud provider doesn't have access. Now I'm going to show you how to launch such virtual machine. First, go to portal.azure.com, enter with your credentials, here, there is a section called Virtual Machines. If you don't see it because you don't use it often, go to More Service and look for it or search for it. So, Virtual Machines, Create, Azure Virtual Machine. Here is going to ask the usual fields. There are some to put attention to that I'm going to mention. So. A name, CVM, is OK. The region, you will notice that this feature is not yet available in all regions. I'm going for East US because you will see that it works there. Security type. Here, you should select confidential virtual machines. Now, you will see this warning or more, depending on of the pre-populated data that you get on this form. Why? Because this feature is not available for all image, for all, all disk sizes, and so on and so forth. So once we select the correct security type, we need to select an actual image that supports it. You can see that I have it right here, but it's because I recently used it. But in case that you don't see it, you need to go to select all image, and here you can filter by security type, confidential. You see that there are only two options, Windows and Ubuntu 2004. You select that one. In case that you get a warning here on the size, you need to select a size that is available for confidential virtual machines. There was of the fields on this form as as usual. I will use a key that I have already created here. It makes sense, this is optional of course, but it makes sense also to use an encrypted disk. Review and create. You can double check that everything is as expected and you are good to go. Create. This is going to take some seconds. After some seconds, the process finish and show you the confirmation page. That's the end of our demo. This innovative kind of virtual machine is available today, enabling you to bring even the most sensitive workloads to the cloud. This is especially useful for regulated industries. This is yet another example of canonical strong commitment to security and another reason why developers and users and enterprises across the world continue to choose Ubuntu on all major public clouds.